I just gave it a Hail Mary and chucked it to the net while there was two girls screening and then somehow it went in. Like I, to this day, I have no idea. As the clock winds down, the crowd stands up and they touch twice. The Cougars tie it up with 1.8 seconds left to go in this gold medal game. What a moment. Concordia fans thought they were saved. We knew we had our hands full, obviously, defending national champs and uh, a team that had a great season. And, it, you know, certainly we got what we expected. Being the underdogs going into the final game was kind of like, we had nothing to lose, they had everything to lose. The year before we didn't have a whole lot of adversity and we felt if we embraced that adversity, that was gonna help us when it mattered, um, and it did. Just 38 seconds to go here in regulation. It's six on five for the Cougars. They've got to get one to stay alive. Tie things up here in this gold medal game. Big shot by Trotter. Honestly, I think we all just looked at each other and we we had a spark. I know obviously Scott drew up a play. I don't remember what the play was. I know it didn't work out. I ended up with the puck behind the net and then I made a bad pass to Emma Bergeson. Like I think I rimmed it to her or something. And then I don't know if she passed it to Athena on the far side or what happened there, but then I came up to support Athena and she had two girls on her. She tried to make a move and then lost it. And then it popped out right to me. As the clock winds down, the crowd stands up and they touch twice. The Cougars tie it up with 1.8 seconds left to go in this gold medal game. It was just pure shock. I remember all the girls like just turning around. We're all like, arms were flying. Like it was so nuts. And then everyone's on the bench and Scott's like, we still have 1.8 seconds left. Like we need five girls out there. Anyone go. It was unreal. You know, we were unfocused out of joy and they were probably unfocused because you know they you know it was it was right there and it just slipped away at the last second so one thing that i would rewatch is like how concordia's bench just kind of their body language was just to crush their confidence there again scores the biggest goal to that point in our program history uh i guess we could argue that maybe the the, the one that the next one was probably the biggest well, leah joma with a chance She'll fire it in, and it's in! The Royal University Cougars are your new U Sports Women's Hockey Champions! And what a moment! History made on the ice in Montreal! That's the goal I watch quite often. It's just like when Emma Bergeson scored, it's just, oh, like it gives me chills to this day. And then watching everyone's gloves go up, watching them video everyone rush to the huddle it, it's just yeah it was incredible like something you don't experience very often pretty big moment in the program's history um pretty big moment in our school's history to be honest that's the first national championship you know that we had won i just want to be someone that everyone remembers whether it's because of a laugh or a effort on the ice like i just want to i just want to be remembered in some way